What is up guys, Jarv here, back today jumping into Destiny 2. Now in today's video, we're taking a look at an awesome third person glitch. So if you want to play Destiny 2 in third person on Europa, then be sure to stick around and enjoy the video. If you do enjoy the video, be sure to leave a rating down below. That super helps me out here on the channel. And if you're new around here, I want to keep up to date with all the latest Destiny 2 content, then be sure to hit subscribe as well. But without further delay, guys, let's jump into the video. Now, Destiny 2 is very much recognized as one of the best first person shooters out there. But in today's video, we're going to approach the game in third person and see how you can activate it on Europa. But before we do that, before we jump into the meat of today's video, I want to once again invite you all to the Jav Community Hub. This is a fast growing community discord we have with over three and a half thousand amazing guardians. So whether it's talking about Destiny, sharing your god roles or even some awesome clips that you've got through the season so far then be sure to jump in it's available to absolutely everyone and you can find the link to our community discord down in the video description below now as far as we know this is one of the first third person glitches on europa at the moment there was a similar glitch back in shadow keep that allowed you to do exactly the same thing on the moon but this time we're going to replicate it over by cadmus ridge and charing's crossing so if you head over to charing's crossing where varix is and make your way towards cadmus ridge you want to get to a point over here on the floor where you can see your abilities activating and deactivating now they will deactivate when you enter the social space which is what's happening when all the bars gray out however when you're in a public space they will all be active as they normally would be what we're going to be doing here though is activating our super but then jumping straight in to a social space this will deactivate the super that we have and if you can do it correctly it will activate third person for you now as you can see from the footage we are on a warlock today chaos reach is by far the easiest way to initiate third person on Europa. You can also use the Stormcaller if you're on a Warlock 2. The only other alternative on any other class is possibly the Titan and the Barricade being an effective alternative to any of the super abilities in order to activate this glitch. Now once you've initiated third person you are free to roam Europa as you normally would inside the public space so whether that be patrols, public events or regular lost sectors you can complete any activity whilst in this mode. You can use any of your abilities with the exception of your super so grenades, melees and any of your class abilities you can use those at your free will. Now the only other thing to bear in mind is if you die at any point it will reset this glitch you will spawn in first person as you expected to so if you do want to activate this again you'll need to head back to Cadmus Ridge and Charon's Crossing to reinitiate third person. Now all in all it's very surprising how well Destiny even plays in third person obviously we can use swords to activate third person whenever we like however to be able to actually fire a primary or kinetic weapon whilst in this mode is very interesting indeed although trying to snipe without a scope is a very interesting interesting challenge inside pve so there we have it guys that is how you activate third person mode on europa in beyond light so if you haven't tried it already it's a fun glitch to try and makes for some interesting challenges on some of the public events inside destiny 2 now to round out the video we're going to leave some gameplay of me doing a public event over here in cadmus ridge entirely in third person so if you want to see that for yourself be sure to stick around and enjoy the rest of the video this is going to be my final video for 2020 i know it's been a very interesting and challenging year for many reasons here's hoping 2021 can be a much better year for everyone wherever you are i hope you have a great new year and wherever you are in the world stay safe and i'll see you guys all again very soon now if you have enjoyed the video be sure to leave a rating down below that super helps me out here on the channel and if you are new here i want to keep up to date with all the latest destiny 2 content running throughout the new year then be sure to hit subscribe as well i'm gonna jump back into the game as always guys and i will catch you all again very soon Devils for Varix and his allies. We ask the Guardian's help. <laughs> <laughs>